the Tylenol murders. In September 1982, 12-year-old Mary Kellerman from Chicago complained of a runny nose and sore throat, and was given a Tylenol capsule to ease the symptoms. Unknown to her family however, it was laced with a lethal dose of cyanide. In the next few days, Mary, along with six other people across the state were dead. It wasn't long before police linked the deaths to tampered Tylenol capsules. Fear quickly spread and manufacturer Johnson & Johnson cut all production and advertising for the product. It was found that the bottles hadn't been tampered with during production, but instead someone had opened them in stores, injected the cyanide and resealed them. Over the next few years, hundreds of copycat attacks took place across the United States, and eventually all bottles were changed to tamper-proof as well as Tylenol moving to mostly solid pill form. Numerous suspects have been investigated, including the Unabomber Ted Kaczynski, but the case remains unsolved. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.